the Minnesota Film Festival. Please power down your phone and refrain from photography, recording, social media during the performance. After the show, log on to minnesotafilm.org to find out more all about 136 production in the festival. Write a review of this one or make a tax deductible donation to Fringe. Later tonight, stop by Free Central, hosted by Red Star Super Club, to socialize with artists and audience members who, like you, support adventurous art. And now, enjoy the show!
to Queen Beyonce. <laughs> This could be a big opportunity. Help Queen Beyonce and you'll see a lot more jobs coming your way. And what if I say no? I'll just put a contract on ice for another 300 years. Your choice. That doesn't sound like much of a choice. It is. It's just both your options are terrible. <laughs> Fine, I'll do it. Excellent. Now go forth, Mavi, and bring the boy to me as soon as you can. The fate of the forest, nay. The world depends upon thee. Now fly, Mabby, fly! <laughs>
tree magic. <laughs> Did you know why you just warp us inside? Hey now, hey, hey. Magic does not grow on trees. <laughs> now, let me see that emerald. Oh, see how it shines. Just a shame I can put my whole life essence into it. Your, your whole life essence? But, but you don't need... Yes, not for too long, I will die. You could almost say that you killed me! <laughs> I wouldn't know. I don't have much time left, so hear me out. There is a powerful object made up of three golden triangles left behind by the goddesses who created this world. The Triforce. There is a man from the desert who wishes to obtain the Triforce and use it to take over Hyrule. Only Queen Beyonce can stop him. Well, how are we supposed to do that? Go to Hyrule Castle. Seek the princess there and show her the Kokiri Emerald. Business. 
Where are my manners? I am Ganondorf, son of the Gerudo. I request an audience with the king. Why should the king see you? The Gerudo tribe is nothing more than a band of thieves and liars. Come now, you don't believe everything about my tribe, do you? How do I know you're not lying? Ah, so much for Hylian hospitality. First off, I'm not Hylian, I'm Sheikah. And if I recall, it was your people who drove my people off their land. And it was the Hylians who drove my people off of this land. They're not so different to you and I. Oh, that is exactly something a bad guy would say. <laughs> I also ask you to kindly step aside, or else you'll have to use force. Actually, yes. And if I were you, I'd turn around right now and go back where you came from. I am right where I came from. Let's go! Ladies first. Ah! Yeah. Emma! What in the name of Miyamoto is going on out here? <laughs> this man was insistent on seeing you, sire. And I was insistent on seeing him out. Forgive my boldness, your majesty. I am Ganondorf of the Gerudo tribe. I wish to speak with you. And you saw fit to attack my personal guard when she wouldn't let you in right away. Uh, yes, I have to be quick. I have an urgent hair appointment this afternoon. <laughs> <laughs> well, I do admire a man who appreciates the importance of punctuality. What? Oh, now, now, Impa. Let's hear him out. Please continue, Mr. Dork. <laughs> Ganondorf, you know what Castletown needs? A new bomb shoe bowling alley with a private lane just for the king. Maybe a new venue for live entertainment? Maybe some burlesque shows? I know some Gerudo women would be more than happy to volunteer. <laughs> so you can't seriously be entertaining this on, on the contrary! I think a little entertainment is just what we need around here. Yeah, I like the cut of your jib, Ganador. Hey, why don't we continue this conversation in my private quarters? Ah, come on. <laughs> oh, Ippa! Ooh, be a dear and check on Zelda for me. Won't you? Of course, my uh, Okay. I would try to smile more. You'll be prettier that way. <laughs> <laughs> yes, another excellent idea. Let's see a smile. <laughs> yeah, we'll, we'll work on that. <laughs> Come on, Mr. Dwarf. Is he gone? For now. I'm sorry they treated you like that, Impa. My father can be such an oaf sometimes. All the time. <laughs> Princess, what was it you wanted me to do? Well, what now? You know, I feel like breaking into the castle should have been this easy. Who are you? <laughs> oh, I'm Navi, the fairy. This is Queen Beyonce. He's with me. Princess, allow me to remove these intruders. No, Impa, it's all right. You look familiar. You said his name is Queen Beyonce? <laughs> that sounds so cute. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> you were sent here by the great Deco Tree. Kokiri Emerald. It goes with the Goron Ruby and Zora Sapphire. We need all three to open the back chamber of the Temple of Time. Who? What's in the Temple of Time? The legend says there's a great power that rests there, but it's been sealed for ages. And that's where you come in. Queen Beyonce, I need you to go out and retrieve the other two gems for me. What do you say to this boy? Do you accept the princess's task? Very well. In the meantime, what should we do about that man? Oh, what man? Ganondorf. Oh, and I was thinking this garden would be the perfect location for your fully featured, no expense bed, theme park and swimming pool. <laughs> Amazing! It never occurred to me that we could exploit our natural resources for cheap consumerism. <laughs> Speaking of exploitation, have you ever thought about who would be staffing these new commodities? No, I've never thought about anything. <laughs> <laughs> just south of here is a forest full of naive Kokiri children who would gladly work for just a rupee a day. <laughs> a rupee a day? How foolish of them, right? Uh, how much is that? <laughs> Please tell me that man's not the only thing standing between us and the apocalypse. I'm afraid so. We better get going, Queen Beyonce! We should come up with a way to show you're with the royal family. Your instrument. I have one too. The Ocarina of Time has been passed on my family for generations. I'll teach you our secret melody. Can you play that? Stranger 
And Puff, do you remember when you offered to teach me the Sheikah arts? I think I'm ready to take you up on that. Of course. Come with me and prepare yourself for the toughest training regimen of your life. And so Queen Beyonce embarked on an epic quest with Maggie by his side. The two would face many perilous challenges across the way, but our hero was more than up for the task. And Maggie was more than up for tagging along. The two would find themselves in the aptly titled Death Mountain, home of the Goron tribe, disguise. Please make some more funny names than Death Mountain! Let's go. <laughs> we prefer to keep our location hidden. Now what is it you seek from us, brother? Oh, um, we had a quest from the Princess of Hyrule. She asked us to get the Goron Ruby. The Goron Ruby? No one's seen that thing in ages. Legend lost the time itself. Oh, here it is. Oh. <laughs> uh, I hope you wash that thing. It's a secret to everyone. Oh, gross. <laughs> well, can we have it then? Not so fast. How do I know you won't use it for evil? You can prove yourselves a nation contest. Oh, here we go. You must defeat me. In a dance off. <laughs> what? We're Gorons. We work hard, we play hard. Come on! <laughs> what do you think, brother? You up for this? All right. We're gonna need some music then. Hey, why don't you play something on that funny looking instrument? Oh, yeah, grab a back beat for us, or uh, whatever you kids call it these days. <laughs> Oh, I thought 
the tree was bad. All right, where's this damage this guy? The entrance is right behind me, but make haste. I do not like to waste time. <laughs> Here, let me move over. <laughs>
All that was left to do was for Queen Beyonce and Navi to sneak into Hyrule Castle and go toe to toe with the Big G himself. <laughs> Good news, we managed to break through. Oh, right, let's get that Ganondorf, let's come into it! Wait a minute, you might want to set this one out. What do I mean? This is an extremely important battle. We can't risk some fairy getting in the way. What do you mean I won't mess anything up? Please, your advice is worthless, you're annoying, and you can't even fight. What good are you? Well, how am I supposed to protect Queen Beyonce? I think you can take care of yourself. Down. All you can do is just get back up. 
You, you may not be the hero, Navi, but you can be a hero. Go. Help Queen Beyonce. Your support is the only shield he truly needs. Seriously, you should bring him that shield. He's getting killed out there. Some way to repay you. Oh, well, I do feel bad for Queen Beyonce. You'll never be able to go home now. 
point of time set you both seven years forward. Maybe we can use it to send him seven years back, and maybe even stop Ganondorf before he takes over. <gasps> But if we can prevent any of this from happening, I think we should still try. Even as kids, we can use the power of the Triforce to see away Ganondorf for good. Well, how about you and I never happen? No, it'll just create a split timeline. Each version of us will have their own separate adventures. There'll be endless debate how it all fits. It's super confusing. And look, <laughs> I don't make the rules of time travel. Well, I guess we can give it a try. I'll send you back to right before he was summoned by the Great Death Machine.
ever. But thank you so much for coming. Have a great rest of Friends! Yeah.